So, it's 7 o'clock on a Friday evening. In about 12 hours, I will be headed down to New Bern, North Carolina to participate in the Noose River Bridge Run. It's a gorgeous 10K that spans the Noose River. But the last time I ran this was in about 10 years ago. In fact, I thought, hmm, I wonder what my friends who ran it with me are doing. So I called them up and said, hey, would you like to participate in the, in the run? They said, yes. It's a great, we've got about three months to train. We all signed up, we all agreed to start training. But after I hung up the phone, I thought three months is a long time. So I waited and then two months came around. I said, still plenty of time to start training, no worries. But then I kind of procrastinated and six weeks, well, six weeks is just like starting basic training. It's not gonna be a problem at all. But then four weeks came around and I still hadn't run. It's like, okay, now I gotta get serious. This is getting concerning. And um, when two weeks came around, I was like, okay, now I'm really nervous. This is crazy. Last week I realized no sense in even trying to train for this thing. So tomorrow I'm just gonna go down and I'm going to attempt to run six miles with no training. And I'd like to do it in an hour and a half without getting injured. So. Of course, if I can do it, that's fantastic. If I can't do it, I'm just going to go down there and enjoy myself and enjoy seeing my friends. All right, well, I best get some rest until tomorrow then. So it's 5.15 in the morning. Uh, I've got my bagel, I've got my coffee. I've got about an hour's ride down to New Bern. And I'm trying to get excited for this morning's run. Uh, a little bit of spitting rain and immensely dark. But uh, it should be a, a fun morning, so on to Newburgh. These are sections I love. Running up the bridge, watching all the fellow runners. Mile down, feeling fine. Gorgeous morning, great run, lots of participation. And uh, well, let's keep it going. I think people have moved these markers. That two miles was a lot longer than on my couch last night. Four miles down. And this is what I love about running down here. It's when the sunlight comes over that bridge. Hey! This is the hardest section for me because the bridge part is over with. And now it's just running in a historic se section of New Bern. But it seems longer than the bridge. <laughs> okay, now it's really tough. I'm just simply tired. There are medics at the end. There are medics at the end. All right, coming to the finish line. from 
Washington. Thank you. 647. Okay, so I'm at the finish line. It's not bad, not bad at all. I'm not winded and uh, feel pretty good, really. Surprise. And there were medics at the end. So that just proves that uh, sometimes you make more of something than it really is. And on that note, it was time to say goodbye to another Noose River Bridge run. As in years past, it was beautifully organized, and I cling to the thought of returning to this charming little colonial town. If ever in the area, one should take the time and visit New Bern, North Carolina. With its 17th century mansions, homes, and history, it's certainly worth the stop. So until our paths meet again, a goodbye to my friends, to the city of New Bern, and to the Noose River Bridge Run.